Block Layout Objects In this tutorial, we're focusing on the use of block and polygon objects in VizTable, perfect for early stage planning. Open the Catalog Block Layout. Now you can drag and drop the desired shapes into your layout. This is especially useful for block layout planning when creating the entire structure with blocks. Block layout objects are versatile and easy to manipulate. You can rotate and move the block layouts fairly easily. Under Properties in the dynamic menu, you can change the width, length and height, or even adjust and lock the planned area size. Once the area size is locked, it will always remain constant when you change the length and width. If you wish to scale the area, unlock the area size and grab the corners. To do this proportionately for both sides, hold down the Shift key while dragging a corner. In case you need to rotate the labels of the block layout, you can also do this here under Properties. For single items or for all at once. In case you want to move the label, just grab this yellow corner and drag it. It is important to mention that there are block layout objects with and without a boundary line. It is advised to use layouts with borders for production areas to clearly mark the area, while using layouts without borders for transportation routes, so there are no lines at intersections. For more complex shapes, polygons are your go-to tool. They allow you to fill irregular spaces efficiently, ensuring no area is wasted. 